Welcome to Weeding Aloud, and big news today, got the email that I've been waiting on, the round two beta testing, I got a list of the pharmacies that we're going to be testing, and I've actually been doing a little bit of research on these guys. The uh, first one up is MedMen. Says dispensaries are still on the move, and the number of open locations is now at 77 in the state of Florida. Three new players are about to enter the market in the year of 2019 MedMen, Columbia Care, and Rise. Some of the brands will be running an end of the year special, sending you details on whether it's worth it after the Christmas season. For the shop, Florida dispensary platform. We now have over 1,000 beta testers signed up. That's me for round two. This one's going to be big and developed in time. The beta test will include something very special. Mm, I love the sound of special. And beta testers will, as always, prizes will be awarded to the top participants including Amazon gift cards. And you can believe I'm going to try and get that shit. I don't care how cheap it is. I'm just going to be a, a participant. Let me scroll up here a little bit. Florida Dispensary's beta test will be happening early in the 2019 year. Blah, 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 blah. Personal stuff. And number of dispensary, 77. Number of doctors in the state of Florida, 1,899. So we're gonna start out with MedMen. I know that they're having locations in Orlando. I think it's Fort Lauderdale, Miami, and possibly Gainesville. But I do know that MedMen is already delivering since um, I think like the 15th of December or something like that. I'm not sure when. But they are delivering in the greater Orlando area. So if you live in the greater Orlando and you have a license already, you can already access MedMen's limited supply that they're delivering. Okay, here we go. MedMen. What do they have to offer? What is their past history? MedMen. Bring a friend. 20% off if you bring a friend. Take pride in providing the best products. We study and test each product before we make it available to you. High CBD strains. Oh, I love these. These are their, right here, their, their little bud tainers. They got, I don't know if you can tell, they got a, like a magnifying glass and a little spring-loaded door so you can get a whiff without cracking the seal oh my god this has got to be patented it's amazing amazing very smart very smart design can't wait to get some of that i doubt that we'll probably get those though store locations here we go here's their other store locations i'm pretty sure that most of them yeah, like lots of them and like they got LA, three, four in LA, one in Orange County, one in San Diego, two in Venice Beach. And these are the ones coming up for Florida. We got Key West, Miami, Orlando. The Orlando delivery service is already open. And last but not least, West Palm Beach. None for Jacksonville. Fuckers. Got them in Las Vegas, four in Las Vegas, one in Buffalo, one in Long Island, one in New York City, and one in Syracuse. So four in New York. There's the map of all their locations. And you can, as you can see, these are the locations in Florida, right there. As I said, the closest location is going to be like Orlando. To me so I'm probably not gonna be able to test this one out except for what they what they mail me I'm not gonna be able to I'm 
Looks like they've been in business for a while. Reputable business. 19 facilities for this one company in five states and 1,100 employees and counting. So, I mean, that says a lot for MedMen. They've already shown that they are industry leaders or not leaders, but industry uh, providers or... or all right, let's go on to Columbia Care. Let's see what they got going on. Columbia Care. A patient-centered healthcare company setting the standard of care of medical marijuana. Give me one second here, guys. And oh, the whole reason I haven't uploaded a video in a while is because of this. Fucking internet. There's their symbol. The Columbia Care Leaf. Much like Cure Leaf and True Leaf. Kind of harping on those leaves, ain't they? Columbia Care continues to expand its presence in Pennsylvania with an opening dispensary in Wilkes Bar, BuzzFeed. Cut pot help solve the opioid crisis. Columbia Care leads the U.S. cannabis industry towards global expansion by becoming the first American company licensed in the European Union. Columbia Care and the Centers for Discovery to collaborate. Examine the use of cannabis-derived medicines in the treating of epilepsy. Columbia Care secures good manufacturing practices, GMP certification for the medical cannabis manufacturing facility in Florida that is to come soon with their products. So that's good. Good to hear. Their Florida uh, manufacturing facility has been certified with the GMP certification. But it's in Acadia, Florida. Uh, looks like they may have opened that up in just in November, just a few months ago. So they're pushing forward pretty quick here in Florida. The Columbia Care is. We gotta keep moving though. Rise. I'm most curious about this one. I've never heard of them. Rise. That might just be a uh, you know fluke. It may be a big company, and I may just have never heard of them. It happens. No, not the movie Rise and Rotten Tomatoes. God, the stupid iPhones. Like if you don't put medical or dispensary before it, it'll just bring up any old shit. Okay, Rise Dispensary. <coughs> oh. Medical marijuana dispensaries that are passionate about providing the finest medical and recreational possible sounds good rise with us we are passionate about providing you with the finest canvas products making you feel right at home uh, rise and shine spanish spring rise batista now open batista you gotta be shitting me batista's part of this with unmatched customer service. It can't be the same Bethesda, could it? The game maker? Cannabis classrooms. Rise, New York ribbon cutting. Happy second birthday, Rise, Carson City. Rise on Lake Erie, Rise at Lake Tahoe. 
It looks like they are a little bit. Uh, they're like in Nevada. It looks like New York. Uh, maybe North, no, like Virginia, New York, and just got a weird flag here. Look like two, two in California, two in Washington or Virginia, one in New York, and one in what? What, what did I say that was? Lake Ontario or Lake Erie? Lake Erie. So. Michigan or something, I don't fucking know. Whatever, state borders, Lake Erie, okay. I'm not a fucking map. Anyway, but I am stoked to see these new products, to see these new stores open. Um, while I'm here, I do want to say that I placed an order last Friday for... Um, True leave it was and I just got a phone call today telling me that not only was my order not gonna be here on the day that I ordered it but it was gonna be here like three or four days later because they were being audited and I was like no sir cancel that order I will call someone else so when I do finally get around to getting their products I may review them and the fact that they blew me off and canceled my order and all that other stuff may have a bearing on how I view their products. I'm sorry to say as much as I hate to try and do that. But the company that I previously naysayed because their pins, their, their in-house Satera pins just burned up so extremely quick came through and within 24 hours told me that my order would be here tomorrow and I had nothing to worry about. Although it was a little bit overpriced, I ended up spending maybe about 50 to $75 more than I would have at this other place. But most of that's because I would have got that $75 first time customer discount from the other place. So it kind of evens out. And it says a lot for Sotera and their online phone and delivery service. So I got a couple more strains coming. The Granddaddy Perp, the Artso G, some of their most popular strains. They didn't have my semos in there. And I think I got the Dosist Bliss, which I really wanted to try. So all that's going to be coming up tomorrow on the next review. But I wanted to just you know touch base with you guys let you know about the florida dispensaries coming through the med men the columbia care rise many many new locations many 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 new dispensaries popping up just from the sound of this email it sounds like i mean we only had four so you know three more that's almost doubling it this year just in the first portion of this year so Gotta love that, guys. Spread the wealth and spread the word. Marijuana is on its way. All those patients in Florida that can't get it, just hold on. It's a coming. This is weeding aloud. And as always, span near to your pets and keep it between the lines. That'll keep you safe. Now, have a wheelchair like me.